Today's review is about chronic renal failure. Chronic renal failure is very common in geriatric cats. Chronic renal failure may sometimes be a result of an inherited defect such as polycystic kidney disease in Persian. signs are usually not evident until 75% of renal tissue is affected. No clinical signs until Renal tissue is damaged. And hallmarks of the disease are anemia, polydipsia, polyuria, isocyanuria. Isos. Azotemia with increased BUN and PUPD, wait, PUPD, and isocyanuria with urine specific gravity ranging from 1.008 to 1.012. And this is important values to remember because if you remember the values for isocyanuria, you can automatically remember or guess the value for hypo or hyperthenuria. え、マセジウゼンは高齢の猫によく見られ、え、ペルシャ猫の遺伝疾患であるタハツテノホジンとしても、の結果としても見られることがあります。え、臨床症状は75%の腎組織がダメージを受けるまでは、えっと、臨床
hypokalemia and hyperphosphatemia can happen. Hypokalemia is due to excessive renal loss because of the polyure uh, polyuria and anorexia, anorexia and chronic metabolic acidosis and that will all lead to hypokalemia and chronic renal failure. And you can see hyperphosphatemia in chronic renal failure because phosphorus is cleared by glomerular filtration. So decreased glomerular filtration rate will result in a high serum phosphorus, which is a hyperphosphatemia.え、尿の縮の乳慢性腎不全は So now, for the management of chronic renal failure, we have to do a lot of things. Um, we have to prescribe anti-hypertensives, uh, dietary phosphorus restriction, restriction and H2 receptor agonist and if there's anemia erythro and most importantly fluid Restrict the phosphorus intake uh, because to maintain phosphorus homeostasis and slow the disease progression, and restrict the protein to alleviate uremic signs. And for H2 receptor agonist, uh, often used um, often use famotidine, which helps decrease vomiting due to high gastric acidity. And erythropoietin is for cats with that shows a clinical signs due to anemia. And most importantly, you should remember about fluid therapy. え、慢性腎不全の管理療法としては、え、抗高血圧療法、臨の制限食、えっと、H2受容体、タンパクの制限、と、H2受容体作動薬の処方、応答をするための処置となります。で、貧血が起きている場合はエリスロポエチンそして